My name's Alyssa Mariano. I'm the co-founder and CEO of Bazara. I have over 10 years of experience, mainly from the marketing and tech side. Um, I grew up in upstate New York, went to school at West Virginia University, and lived in New York City for about five years before I moved to Dubai in 2017. I'm super passionate about thrifting, buying and selling secondhand, and when I moved to Dubai in 2017, I realized there was a big gap in the market for a mainstream resale fashion platform. So that's why I started Bazaar. There are other platforms that are general marketplaces where you can buy and sell more general things such as electronics, cars, and there's marketplaces that are dedicated to luxury fashion, but there is nothing dedicated to mainstream resale fashion in the region. And in the West, there are so many other marketplaces such as Poshmark or Depop, but there is no similar marketplace here in the region. So that's why I created Bazaar. There were several obstacles and challenges that I had faced along the way, um, not only as a founder, but also as a female founder. So as a female founder, of course, there are unfortunately still some gender biases and sometimes I face imposter syndrome. Um, but overcoming those challenges are quite easy when you have a really strong support network and people that support you and you just learn to kind of believe in yourself through those. When we launched Bazaar in 2020, that was unfortunately right when the COVID pandemic happened. So unfortunately, a lot of people lost their jobs during that time. With Bazaar, people can actually earn a lot of extra cash on the side while they're selling their clothes that they haven't worn in months. So that was really a great way to see how people could use the app and we can actually help benefit them. Um, they can earn extra cash on the side, especially when they lost their jobs. It can help them support their lifestyle for a couple of months while they look for a new job. Our long-term vision is we want to become the go-to marketplace for all things circular fashion in the region. Um, a couple of things that we have in the pipeline that are super exciting. So we're launching a brand new version of the app in the coming months. We are launching in Saudi over summer 2023 and Egypt by the end of the year. What I love most about living in Dubai is how connected it is to other places in the world. It's a super easy place to travel from. It's a global hub and um, that's why I love it. Start the day off by waking up late. I would then make myself a massage appointment at the spa that's right behind the house in Jumeirah at the Mandarin Oriental. And then I would spend the day at the pool with a good book on Kindle. I really love Thai food, um, especially if it's vegan. So I would go out and explore the local restaurants that are around, maybe try something new. And then I would end the evening quite early and get an early bedtime. <laughs>